What's up, YouTubers? It's Cam Rock. SDL. I'm here at the Farmer's Market, the St. Louis historic Farmer's Market. I'm in Speak up. I got little ghetto-ass plants in the fucking shop. We parked here. How are you doing? She's doing real good. She just she just got a Ford Focus. Yeah, she's doing real good. <laughs> anyway, take a note of something. We don't pay the goddamn meters here on the weekends. It's Saturday. It's early enough, but damn it. I don't know who paid it before us, but we didn't put that money in that goddamn. But I'll tell you what, you don't pay meters on the weekend. Okay. Ain't no meter maids working. It's just SEO little thumb. Saturday and Sunday, you don't pay the goddamn meters. So all you rookies and amateurs, stop paying the street park on the weekends. We don't do paying for the weekends on street park. It's not something we do in St. Louis. So, as you see, we park for free to come here to the St. Louis market. Uh, you know, you can pay. It's a pay lot right there. With all them fucking signs and shit. And right behind it is the fucking, uh, oh, and look at the scene. Look at this beautiful historical looking ass factory in the goddamn shot in the back. <laughs> the damn, you know, the tripod of, uh, come over here. Let me, let me, let me, let me. Let me. Let me. Get, try to get my own I'm shot. Yeah, look at that old ass looking factory and shit. If you can see, I can't zoom with this damn camera. The, the historic farmer's market sign is right there. So anyway, I'm Cam Rock, man. If we just park, I'm going to walk you down. Yeah, with the show on the right. She's doing real good. She just leased the Ford Focus. Yeah, she's doing real good. <laughs> well, she ain't leasing. She's buying it, you know, but whatever. She's going to buy it. Yeah, she's financing it. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, here. So we're going to walk over here to the damn, you know, to the damn market, you know, to the damn market. You still can't see that sign. Alright, so it's like, my phone is a little ignorant, but it's all good. Anyway, so look, once again, uh, this ain't a vlog channel or a blog or anything like that. I'm trying to do, I'm just uh, letting y'all see a little taste of St. Louis, let y'all see how I live and how it is to be here. Uh, we say her, we say that, we say all that shit. But uh, since I went to college for a little bit, I learned to speak just slightly different for a little bit. You know, and it suits me just fine. Here goes some more of the market right here, we coming up on it. We got local vendors and stuff that's doing their thing. Uh, it's a sign on a little building there. It says Sular Farmer's Market, the entrance to the building part of it at least. And uh, this is the indoor section of it. It has an in and outdoor. And this is the part open year round, right? The indoor part. But the outdoor part is live, you know. All the trucks, basically, where the vendors are vending. Yeah, all these trucks. Got vendors doing their vending thing. Every little dumpster has a truck. And, you know, they're doing fresh fruit, vegetables. They uh they got it all. They got it all. The Sular Farmers Market open year round Wednesday to Saturday. The St. Louis, Missouri. St. Louis Sular Farmers Market. Established in 1779 by my great old pappy, Daddy McDaniel. No, I'm just joking. Mm -hmm. Anyway, thanks y'all. Uh, please subscribe, uh, like the vid and the channel and the other shit that we're doing, and uh, you know help us get as many likes and views as we can get. It, it's not the little setup look. Really nice, you know. Spice setup. Antique. Very antique. Yeah, right, right, right. You know, look at the outside part. The market office. You know. Show you a little bit. I'm see a little taste of it, you know. Look at those damn eggs. This is right off the chicken's ass, you know, type of eggs over there. You know, I'm look just right down the center all the way down on top of it. There we go. Yeah, yeah. See how long the market is for this outside stuff for this one little wing. It's four of these. Right, we got four of them total. Right? They're selling live rabbits. You can watch my household cat, whatever, you know. They're adorable little guys, you know. Yes, it's just Why they segregated? Right, right. Why they segregated? Yeah, like, touch, 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 tou
They might think you can't do it. Ah, I got shit in the footy. <laughs> Big cute little rabbit Klein looking uh, rabbit. I want this rabbit and the lettuce. Cause they're together. <laughs> All right, so you know. Got deals here going on. How you doing? <laughs> Got great looking fruit. Oh, we're just shopping right now. <laughs> Checking it out. The St. Louis, uh, you know. Big tours of thing. You come to St. Louis? If you're lucky enough, visit. Yeah, 65, what, 3 for 190? That's a good deal. 3 for 190, big, big fresh. 65 cents for a single one. That's a good deal. And they're fresh. They really are real fresh, man. Yeah, pick you out a good one. Here we go. So, Shana's going to pick out her, her out of mango and do other things. I was over there playing the touch with the rabbits and everything, you know. They got eggs over there. The Har family farms, best poultry in town. That's true, they've been there since I was a little kid. True stuff, you know. She said the softer they are, the riper they are. Yeah. That big red one right there looks very soft and ripe. Yes, I'm going to trade that one for this. So she's trading out there, you know. So not that one, this one, the big red one. Is that it for you? That's how she's rolling. Right. And you know what? For that, for that, all we have to pay is a dollar. Look, I got a dollar. One American dollar. And, and you get changed back. You get changed back. It's true, you do. Here. Never mind. <laughs> no, no. I'm like, look, watch. Get out one dollar, right? But one dollar purchase one of these fine fruit specimens. Check out the watermelon here. Four bucks for the watermelon. <laughs> The sun. Nice, thank you. Check it out, dude. It's a watermelon. It's a watermelon statue. So St. Louis, right here. All right, you got blueberry eyes. Interesting little mouth, you know. Yeah. Take a piece of this watermelon for $4.75 each. Tomatoes, $1.45 for a full fucking box. Look at that. $1.45 a box. Tomatoes. Oh, wow. Really? Two boxes for two eighty five. Let me show you a box of tomatoes. This is a little box of tomatoes. There. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at how huge they are hand size. Look at that. Get four of them in there. This is a huge tomato. Look at this. They're L probably. Yeah. And they're huge. Look at this big guy. Look at that. Look at this huge tomato. Get a box up. 145. You cannot beat that with a stick, people. <laughs> you can try. You just wear yourself out. All right, look at this. Ginger root. A dollar ninety for a full pound of The Yukon Gold said two pounds for ninety five cents. Check that out. I definitely think I might want a ginger root. I'm trying to think of what I'm gonna make with it. How I'm gonna prepare it. Right. <laughs> All right. So we got Cookie Lady on Wheels LLC. You know, the Cookie Lady herself. You know, I'm saying she's getting a Mac on right now. You know, ain't gonna bother, but you know, yeah. another St. Louis business local. Gooey butter cake. Big Two Farms LLC. Pure artisan goat cheese. Nice. Yeah, and that sound is going to move for, uh, you know, what I'm going to move for is some food. We're going to eat a hot dog here, some fresh made donuts, two log markets. That's what we do. A dollar each or three for two fitter. I need about two fitter. Garlic, 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 cake. Very interesting. This is a, this is a garlic skate, people. It comes in a little bushel bundle like this. Is it really They're garlic? They're a dollar each. Yeah. Oh, okay. Really garlic, you know, garlic, you know, your bulbs send up, uh, you know. Real garlic. Curling send up those, the flour. Okay. Cut them off, make a bigger bowl. I want one. A dollar. Ha ha. So, get, get film me here. I got my dollar in my hand already. You just hold the camera. <laughs> my one American dollar, I'm going to make a purchase of a garlic. <laughs> of a garlic scope. And for one George Washington, I get my my my, my, my garlic <laughs> at the St. Louis market. 
Sular Market. Check me out. Now, when you come to St. Louis, you got to come by. You're not going to get fresh produce nowhere damn in the hell else. Trust me. That's the real. People are like, nah, our food sucks compared to everywhere else. So, this is organic. All real food, man, and it's grown. So, get a book and check this out. You know what I mean? So, when you're touring and you come in this summer, St. Louis, you got to come by with Sular Martin. This is just one of many reasons why. Thank you. That's just one, one booth. That's just one booth. Yeah, we still got a lot to go. Still got a long day to go, you know? So, uh, yeah, hope you're enjoying the video. Hope you like uh, checking out the, uh, look at that, big This garlic. $24.55 $2 each or two for a buck. And these are regular, real, long garlic cloves. This is tight. I love them. I don't even really know how to cook a garlic like that. But that, Prime I can pay a dollar and get two of them, you know. <laughs> Look at the beautiful flowers. All right? Yeah. You know, fresh out of the garden. You know what I'm saying? How you got real vendors here, you know, real people doing that thing. St. Louis market, you know. You gotta love yeah. it. Fruits are there. Farm yeah, made fruits and everything. <laughs> you know, that, now when I say farm made, I want y'all to understand. I, I don't mean now that it's going to be made some other way. Like, well, I do mean that. I mean, you know, you got GE crops, genetically engineered crops. They're very popular in most stores sell them, you know, especially here in St. Louis. So people, local people especially appreciate our market because we can get, how you know. Uh, well, like how you all come by my visit, uh, we bring on Hollywood to the Cool. Thank you, Hannah. <laughs> you thank too, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we got a, uh, a little, what you call it? A little appetizer. Oh, they got pasta here. And these are uh, flavored, actually. Gluten-free. Check this out. You got to love this. Tri-color. I guess with a tri-color. How much for a bag of tri-color? Uh, pasta. <laughs> Flavored, oh, half pound and a pound. All right, so you got four fifty for the half pound. A pound is eight bucks. And four fifty for the half pound. We're all four four fifty or get two for eight. Two for eight, yeah, and that's half pound. And all of our pasta, I lay them out according to popularity. Starts down there, it's number one best seller, and the second, third, fourth. Okay. okay. Well, then, Dag, I'll tell you what, he's got them based on popularity. He's got a, a great local vendor here selling yeah, pasta. Just pick that up and smell it. The fettuccine smell Italian it. herb right here. You can't smell it today. She picked oh it up and I smelled God. it. Wow. Like I said, Gary, oh, that, that one, you won't need any sauce whatsoever. You won't need sauce whatsoever if you buy it. We're getting it. Yeah, one for four fifty, you get two for eight. Two for eight of them. This uh -huh. is also Italian herb, but it's a bigger noodle. Oh, okay. You get a bigger noodle right there. All right, now, this is an Italian herb. You, you would want tomato basil. Let me check. Tomato basil is good. I, I love it. Yeah. Tomato basil, oh, fettuccine. It already smells like And it's like herb. Regular. Angel hair basil. <laughs> Spicy black pepper. Wild mushroom pasta. Uh, linguine. Squid ink. Squid ink. Squid ink. Yeah. Color with the ink of a squid for real. This is, this is real shit. But the only and thing it smells, tastes good. It's not, cool it's not any kind of a flavor to it, so yeah, you have to have some kind of sauce. You need a sauce with it. You do need a sauce with the uh, squid ink. But it's colored with the, the ink of a squid. This black pasta here really is. That's really tight. Only St. Louis right there, right? Chevron linguine, whole wheat, tricolor. I'm digging the tricolor still. I'm still feeling it. I do dig the tricolor pasta. Very cool. Eggs together, they're out of that. Gluten free pasta, they're out of that. For all the people that are healthy. Taste it. Okay, we're gonna get me tasting raw pasta. <laughs> Italian herb. And for a raw noodle, it's actually really good and flavorful. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. So. So is you off, please. Booyah, there we go. So you want these two. Here's what we're getting. Fettuccine, Italian herb, and we're checking out the tomato basil. Now, with the Louis Market. Italian herb, when you cook it up, just cook it like normal. You know, it takes for like seven or eight minutes to boil it. Sweet. Add, okay. add a little bit of olive oil and a little bit of Parmesan cheese. Mix it together. Mix in some steamed vegetables. Any any kind of vegetable you like. Then on top of it, throw in some like some grilled chicken or maybe some scallops or some shrimp. Nice. If you've got a whole meal, no sauce because you don't need it. Nice. All the flavor is right there. Sweet. 
That is awesome. Our whole recipe. Yes, we do. Tonight. Yes, we do. Thank you, sir. Hey, oh. I'm, I'm always here to help. You ain't got our cash. Can we cash do only. Cash only? Okay. You got cash. I got cash. Yeah. Yeah, the, the guy I work for, he doesn't take credit. He don't take... I he, think. He, he don't take... Hey, nothing. when you're doing the alcohol <laughs> vendors, bring cash. At least 20 bucks cash. Trust me, it goes a long way. You know? But you get such good deals for your cash, I mean, you That's really... That stuff is awesome. Yeah, right. Eight dollars? You got it. Well, We're getting a you. specialized you. pasta. Thank you. You're getting a whole pound of steak. You, you will be coming back. You can't beat that. You like for us. You got, you got to come back. You got to come back for more. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's true. Got that. Right. Check out the different little spreads he's got. Avocado. I got tons of them. You know the different special, extra virgin olive oil. Like you said, you don't even Mexican need sauces for these. Mexican wine. Olive oil. Olive oil. That's awesome. Yeah. Anyway, it's a Cam Rock, man. This is so St. Louis with the Two Mark. We're going to enjoy the rest of our day. The video's been going on long enough. I'm Cam Rock. I'm out here with Sean Frazier. Thanks for liking and watching the video. Please stay tuned. We're going to buy more stuff and see more animals and interesting foods and everything else out here at the market today. Uh, thanks for touring St. Louis with me. And, uh, you know, remember to like the damn videos and subscribe. Y'all got to subscribe and like these things. Apparently, you know, they don't pay you as much or something. I don't know. Anyway, so, you know, this is going to be a real YouTube channel I'm trying to make permanent. So thanks for the support in advance, and I uh, appreciate it. Much love, y'all. Cam Rock, and I'm out.